Thank you. Ah, let me show you over to the red, to the let's see, Let's see, let's see. I'm going to grab more your hand. Uh, well, I'm going to take it out with this, and then I'll hold it. Okay, cool. Are you ready? This is going to be on YouTube. Look at wow. Economy drivers, it's Tony, your hustling hyena, and today is day number 24. 24. I'm trying to save 12 to 15 thousand dollars for a tour car. I currently don't have any orders. In fact, I used to get orders that came straight to my house because I'm close to the Walmart, but because there's so many new drivers, it looks wait, like wait, they wait. are completely Jonah, skipping babe. me. So I am driving to the Walmart. And I'm gonna demand that I get an order. I demand! Oh. I demand! I demand! Anywho, today is a Friday. I know I've had some bad Fridays in my life, but I'm feeling good about this one. So, also might be the caffeine. So, today's gonna be a $200 day. A little bit of good news. Spark sent me an order. $25.88, 3.2 miles, two drop offs. I need about another 30 minutes before it's gonna be ready for me to pick up. So I have my Instacart going and my Grubhub. DoorDash, unfortunately, is not busy yet, but we're gonna see if we can get anything else. How are you? Is it slow? Nothing for two hours? That's not good. How long have you been doing Instacart for? How much do you normally make in a day? What's your average, you think, in a week, then, maybe? That's better. Ooh. Melanie, tell me about your diamond card status. Well, let me tell you, sir. You're supposed to be at the top. I've got five-star rating, supposed to have priority access. Here's what priority access looks like. Three chips, $9. No tip. <laughs> nope. $11. No tip. Nope. All right, little tip. Nope. And it's just the bull nope it never ends nope and i just take screenshots nope. of it all the time oh my god those are terrible nice <laughs> i love it that's from when the raider season was over so uh it's done do you suggest uh getting diamond cards no it's bull this is the second time i've been in it second time i've been getting these orders it's better to stick at platinum all right thank you you're welcome sir. thank you thank you thank you <laughs> So you heard the op. She's been waiting here for two hours and hasn't gotten anything. That sucks. I hope her day gets better. I don't know why she doesn't do Spark. Uh, probably good for me because then I can get more orders, but sucks for her. I hope, you know, hope Instacart gets good for her um, because if it gets good for her, then it gets good for me, right? What is that saying? A rising tide, uh, all the boats go up. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, just got the order loaded up, spark order, and on my way to drop it off. Oh. Little garden. Hello. Oh. <laughs> How are you? Sorry to scare you. No, you didn't. <laughs> You happen to have your ID. Yeah, that's what it's just. I gotta make sure you're at least 21, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, well, you know, the last time I was carded, I was 29 or 30. Spark orders delivered, and now I'm on my way back to the Walmart in hopes that I catch the next round robin, which is the next set of orders. So let's get there quick. One hour later. I ended up getting a good order, but losing a whole hour. $40.38, 5.9 miles to drop off Walmart Spark. How are you today? I'm excellent. How are you? I'm doing all right. Just another day. All right, I can bring it nice and easy. <laughs> Good, nice sun, yeah. No rain. Were no you out rain. In the rain. 
No, I chose not to work in the rain. I will I'll put it right here, if that is the best. Is that, is that the whole thing? Yes, I try to do everything in one. Wow. You one got strong, load. Strong arms. I try to be, I try to be as strong as I can. Good. I've got Ooh. most of your tip online, but I wanted to give you some cash so you don't have to tell them. Oh my God, I appreciate it. <laughs> you need any more help? Can I do anything else? I'm doing good, I'm doing good. I yeah, love it. It's good exercise for me. I've actually seen her before. She's super, super sweet. Love helping her out. And the lovely lady gave me a $5 tip, which is something I feel like I haven't had in about two weeks. So, <sighs> Back at the Walmart and I got a decent order. Not great. $29.39, which is amazing, but 8.6 miles to drop off. So just picked up the order and my buddy told me about doing the Walmart spark trick. And I heard you can get deactivated for it, but I decided to try it and it worked. The reason why is because I was about 25 minutes just waiting in the parking lot with nothing from Instacart or anything else. I decided to do it and I got my order pretty quick. Usually I would have to have waited for 25 minutes before checking in and then waiting like another 10 minutes or something. But yeah, he said he's been doing it for like the last three months with no issues, but I don't know if I'll continue doing this just cause I'm pretty scared I might get kicked out. But one time I can just blame it on the T-Mobile gods, you know? Let me know if you guys do the trick at all or if you think I should continue doing the trick or if that was kind of uh, in bad taste. Oh, this is a big order. Damn, these guys got some eggs. That's some rich stuff right here. So I got really close to my Walmart and I missed the roundabout time. So they didn't give me any orders, but I ended up getting a spark order for another Walmart and it's the nearby Walmart that's about five miles away. $25.81, 5.8 miles, two drop-offs. I'm actually at the Walmart right now to get that picked up. Hi, how are you? Hello, doggy. Yeah, of course. Oh, I don't want to hurt him. <laughs> Nicole! I got your groceries right here. I'm going to put him in the steps just so that you can open the door. Yeah, have a good one. Thank you. Well, hello there. As I was driving back to my Walmart, Spark sent me an order for $23.47 going 2.4 miles, just one drop off. Just got the order loaded up and I also got a Grubhub order from Red Lobster. Now I've never been to Red Lobster to pick something up, so it'll be my first time. Hopefully they're fast and if they're not fast, then this might be the last time I ever go to Red Lobster. Hey, I have a... I have a order from Grubhub for Douglas D. Yes. Whoa. What's your name? What's your name? My name's Jack. We work here at Red Lobster. He's vlogging. He's here for a pickup order. Exactly. Thank you. <laughs> Love it. What's your name? Douglas D. Douglas? Okay. And were you here for a pickup order as well? No. Okay. Do you want to be seated? Yeah, we got another DoorDasher here. What's your name, bro? <laughs> you too, man. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you. Yeah. Well, let me show you over to the red, to the let's see, Let's see, let's see them. You gonna grab them with your hand? Uh, well, I'm gonna take it out with this and then I'll hold it. Okay, cool. Are you ready? This is gonna be on YouTube. Look at wow. it! <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I love it, thank you. You're welcome, you have a good Alright, see you guys. Not gonna lie, Red Lobster seems like it's popping. The manager was there, was being super cool, super helpful, and just being 
overall down for the video. So I appreciate that more than they'll know. Mat? Got that order dropped off and I feel a little weird. I don't know if that's the correct RV. There are no numbers. I saw number 17 and 22, so I knew it was somewhere in the middle. They gave me some direction. They said it's after the laundromat, but I believe what I saw was a laundromat, but it wasn't labeled as laundromat. I don't know. I don't know why people just don't make it easier for everyone. A few moments later. Just got my next order from Walmart Spark, $25.89. This seems like a almost full Walmart Spark day. Grubhub was the only difference. I'm at the Walmart parking lot waiting for the order to get loaded up, but look what I see from my neighbor car. Homie has two phones and is watching Netflix and working. Cause that's a spark screen right there on his phone. Hi, how are you? Hi, how are you? All right, where do I go? <laughs> so I got the first drop off done and I'm on my way to the second drop off. Instacart sent me an order for $16.70 for just five items. So I'm definitely taking it, it's 1.6 miles. And then let's hope Grubhub or DoorDash, who always fails me, can come through and we can end this with over $200. Oh. Oh, man. Yeah, have a good one, bro. We're not at my Walmart, but I don't think it should be that much harder. Let's get it done. A taste of beer. Yes. See what the difference is. Thank you so much. It's delicious. Have a good one. <laughs> Instacart order loaded up and I have some good news. I ended up getting a spark order for my Walmart, which is close to my house with an order that's gonna be dropped off. Not too far from my house, $12.16. And this is what I hate, guys, and I have no idea where the house is. So I thought it was only one drop off, but it's two. But it's still only 2.5 miles, and again, it's gonna leave me real close to the house. What up, man? Yeah, With the cool f***ing Camaro, bro. <laughs> Damn. Damn. What made you start doing Spark, my friend? What's going on? Talk to me. <laughs> oh, I'm actually using this app called... Uh... Point Pickup. Yeah, Point Pickup. Okay. Is I'd... that what you use? Uh, I got kicked out of Point Pickup. You did? Say yeah. That? Um... I really don't like Point Pickup. Would you rather do um, Uber Eats? I feel like I was making more money doing Uber Eats. Another thing with really? Uber Eats too. This is my question though, because this is a beast. How much gas are you spending on Uber Eats versus Point Pickup? 40 bucks a day. Oof. 
40 bucks a day. <laughs> With Uber Eats, I could usually, I could usually bring bring in around 140 to 150 bucks a night. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I mean, if it's 100 bucks a day. I, I point pickup. I think I'm making less money than Uber Eats. Uber Eats, they also pay these a prop 42 or Eats. Yeah, they do. Point pickup is the only one that doesn't do that, and I have no idea why. Yeah. But Spark does that. Insta Instacart does it, but I don't know if you how much space you have in your car. And then, um, why don't you do DoorDash? I applied. Uh, I, I applied for DoorDash, and they're having a hard time verifying who I am. But I bet this is expensive to keep, bro. Is it? Yeah. I bet, bro. I bet. All right, let me get my order, man. Nice meeting you. What's your name? I'm Dave. Dave, what's going on, man? Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Tony. So Dane's super cool, but just like I thought, inflation, things are expensive. $40 a day to add gas to that car. I mean, in all reality, personally, I think I would just sell the car and get something more, but maybe he does shows when he, you know, when he cleans it up, he gets money that way, but that's crazy. Super cool car. I just know I can't afford it. Oh, what up, bro? Chillin', man, chillin'. All right, thank you so much, man. Have a good one. Oh, thank you so much, man. Have a good one. We finally made it. I am done. Yeah, well, hold on. You, you gotta pretend like you gave me the food. Okay. 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 So let okay, me grab it. Are you doing like special delivery for Douglas? Perfect, yeah. Okay, wait, I'm gonna come out and pull okay? All right, come. Go for it. You You're good, yeah. Don't worry, I'll cut you in. Go for okay. it. Special delivery for Douglas? Thank you. Special delivery for Douglas? 